So in this video, I'm gonna answer the question, can people actually catch fire and really burn? Well, actually in a regular atmosphere, like the one that we have at the moment, which is about 80% nitrogen and only 20% oxygen, no, not really. We know that. People, when they're smoking, they don't just burst into flames. But what if our atmosphere was 100% pure oxygen? Would it be possible then? Right, to see how well humans would burn in a pure oxygen atmosphere, what I've got here is a goldfish bowl and I'm pumping a uh, very enriched, almost pure oxygen into it through this pipe from our oxygen concentrator. Now the first thing I'm going to do is establish how well your clothes would burn in essentially a pure oxygen atmosphere. So this is just a piece of my, my, <laughs> my pants, my trousers. And so what I'm going to do first is I'm just going to light this, then I'm going to put it out, and then I'm going to dunk it into the oxygen atmosphere just to see what happens. So you'll see when I set it on fire here that it's just a sort of regular cloth. So it burns okay, yeah? I blow it out, and then when I put it into the oxygen atmosphere, the whole thing burns up in seconds. And just like that, it's all gone. So that's what your clothes would burn like in a pure oxygen atmosphere. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to try the same thing again, but with something that would sort of equate to human skin. And what I'm going to use as a first proxy is chicken skin. Okay, so it's more or less the same deal. I've just got a, a piece of uh, chicken on the end of a piece of wire. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to emulate uh, what my burning clothes would look like from just a, I'm going to put a burning splint in there just under the, under the chicken for just a one or two seconds, okay? So we'll see what happens. So I'm going to blow that out and here we go. So as you can see, people would burn really quite amazingly well and it's, the oxygen's mostly gone at that point. So as you can see, it's a very good thing that our atmosphere is only 20% oxygen, because if it was 100% oxygen, the smoking wouldn't just be bad for your health, it would be suicidal. 